So welcome here with Trustonic. Uh, we're here today to present some key success use cases and solutions for IoT and biometrics. Okay, so how our partners around the trusted execution environment can develop secure applications that then improve the user experience. So my role at Trustonic is Field Marketing Americas, basically helping to develop the strategy for the region, if you like. And Trustonic is now a four-year-old company. Um, I've been with the company since the beginning. And really, our goal is to spread the trusted execution environment across as many devices as possible. And we're about to reach uh, 700 million devices uh, by the end of the year. So we do work closely with chip vendors and device makers, and then we provide the tools to app developers, solution providers, to provide uh, new and better solutions. So we're here today to showcase um, important solutions around biometrics, uh, and also talk about IoT because our main footprint around mobile is great, but we're also expanding to IoT. Uh, as you know, more and more devices get connected, you want to be able to secure these devices and the data that are exchanged between the device and the network. Right? So we do have a very strong partnership with Samsung Arctic. Uh, Samsung Arctic provide a IoT module that could be embedded in automotive uh, home automation, building automation industries. And we do work with them and then address a whole new ecosystem of app developers uh, to leverage this module to provide better and secure uh, services. What I would like to show you now is around biometrics. Everyone talk about password and how people can get rid of passwords. Uh, and actually we have a great example here with one of our partners, Hyper, which is a company that provides secure biometric authentication for uh, financial institutions, insurance companies, for example. And I'm about to show you the solution developed by our partner, Hyper, uh, a company that provides secure biometric authentication for financial institutions and uh, insurance companies. So the goal is really to get rid of the password, which is painful and that can, you can forget, so to improve the user experience and preserve the good level of security on the device. So here, I just launched my mobile banking app. The only thing I need to do really is to launch the app, eye scanning, and here I am. I'm already in. So it is as simple as that. But what's very important as well, it's, it's not only about the convenience again, it's also about security. So for example, here, what we did really, uh, we took a picture of my eyes, okay? So now what I'm going to show you is, I'm going to try to log in to the application using a picture. So here I launched the app, uh, and here I'm scanning my eyes on my picture. And access denied. So basically, it doesn't only recognize that this is me, it makes sure that this is actually someone physical presents in front of the phone. And all of the biometrics, processing, authentication is here secured within the trusted execution environment. So what it requires.